Nation. This is a spin-off game that uh, takes place during, I think, the time of Samurai or something, because as you can see, the main character has a sword, but he also has a gun. So I really don't know if it takes place during a real period of time or not, but... Uh, last time, we had a little bit of chaos. We had, um, we had Kiryu, uh, going crazy because his adopted daughter was in a coma. We had the mystery of the baby, which turned out to be hers. And then we had to track down who the father was. Almost like this was the Mori show or something. Then, uh, we tracked him down. There was some big twists. We found out the secret of Omarachi, which apparently was a giant battleship that uh, was around during World War II, and apparently they built it. So, um, yeah. Uh, lots of other stuff happened. Did I end up in jail this time? Yeah, I did. At the very beginning of the game, Kiryu had to go to jail and it, for like three years. And then Hakura, she decided to leave because of the thing that she revealed last uh, game where she, she's the adopted daughter of a Yakuza. So, yeah, she had to go leave because her idle days were over because people didn't like the fact that she's the adopted daughter of a Yakuza. And then we go to jail, we go to find her, she's not there. Then we go track her down, we find that she's in a coma, then we find that she has a baby, then we go to find the father. We found the father, which was a twist apparently, even though I kind of saw it coming. And then we found out that... The town that he lived in apparently had a secret where underground they have a battleship waiting that decommissioned during World War II and that nobody need no boat because it would be illegal to harbor such a weapon. And then the ending uh was apparently some people in the Tojo clan were against us. And now comes the spin-off. So that was all number six. So we won't get to see that progress continue at least until the next game. But this is going to be the game that takes place in between. I don't know how long it is, but I'm going to suffer through it probably. Mostly the story. So, let's start up here. Settings. Let's make sure that everything is on. Good, yes. Bloodiness. Heavy, yes. I love blood in my video games. For the moment, I'm trying not to break character while trying to do the intro. After, I'll break character. Scene. Audio. Let's make sure that s title's not on. Nice display. Okay. Brightness, okay. Text, subtitles on. Speaker names in subtitles. Um, I don't think I need that. You can pretty much tell who's talking when uh, going on, so I don't need that. Medium, I think that should be good. Wait. Yeah. Ex 
accessibility. Do I need any accessibility? Yeah. Enable or disable the automatic success of all quick... Eh, I'll leave all that off because I can do the quick time events myself unless it's like really difficult stuff. If it's difficult stuff, I'll turn this on, but other than that, I don't really need any of that. Alright, so again, I don't know when this is going to take place. I, I guess during the time of Samurai, so... And it's uh, basically the characters of Yakuza in this game, so we'll see their faces, but it won't really be them. It'll just be them with a different name. So... I think default brightness should be good. Turn on autosave, yes. I hope that there's a manual save in this game. But if not, then that's gonna suck. Oh, right there we got the uh, ancestor of Majima. That is Sajima. That is Jima Daigo. Is this going to be first person mode? I hope not. Kind of like it being third person. Let's see. I was gonna look up. I was gonna look up if there was this manual save. ずっと Alright, so that must be Kiryu's ancestor. <clears throat> what? No, you just straight up bought by one. The best one I ever got. That cost me like twenty-seven dollars. The same thing. How do you not
guess the music sounds alright right now. Where are we sailing to anyway? I guess we're just going to new land or something? This game is good. I wish the other one would be available. Apparently there's another what-if scenario. Uh, what's it called? Uh, it's not Ishin, but it's a different one. Well. I'll put auto on so it will just do it for me. Achievement. Already. Nice. Alright, so let's see what everything looks like. That's my inventory, equipment. I have my, uh, my katana, so I am going to be able to equip better weapons. I'm going to be able to have a gun as well. Okay. That's going to be my abilities. Is this in our life? There's going to be sub stories in this. I don't care about that right now. Um, what else? Do we have a manual save in this? Yes, we do. Thank goodness for that. <coughs> yeah, does the game tell me where I've got to go? No. It just tells me I should walk around town for a bit. Okay, I can do that. Do 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 do. Man, those pants are so baggy. I don't know how the samurai could manage wearing that. I probably sound culturally insensitive saying that, but I'm just saying, like, how can you wear this? I mean, look at that. And all the ladies look the same too, like they all have the same hairstyle, the same kind of clothes on, it's like no one here looks attractive. Like what if I want to get laid? But what? Trade you what? For what though? How did he ruin it? 
So, take it. Being defiant. Oh shit. Oh yeah, I forgot samurai were also kind of douchebags back then. I mean, they're supposed to really be they're supposed to be honorable, but apparently they're not like. They're definitely, they're honorable in a sense, but they're also kind of douchebags. Back then, a stomach ache could be fatal. Are you sure they would help you? Are you sure you're not blind to the fact that you, there's probably like a clan of samurai that would help you, but there's like other clans who would be like against you? That's the way I see it. の夢風情が何を抜かす。そうじゃ。土佐では上司が絶対わしらに逆らうことなど許されんのじゃ。たく土佐は一一を牢に入れ出させる。Alright, let's see what the combat is going to be like. I hope it's not bad. You can tell me. Yeah, so they're only going to hear my... Response to whatever you're gonna say. Just tell me what you need to tell me. Oh. 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 しかしにこの町ごと焼き払われかねないからな。なんじゃと。後で報いは受けてやる。だがお前らにも女を殴った報いを受けさせてやる。ああ、I'm uh, about to fight. You could watch if you want. But you'd have to read the subtitles because everything is in Japanese. Alright, so what's the fighting gonna be like? Is the fighting gonna be normal? Yep. Okay, good. Am I gonna be able to grab people? Okay. As long as I'm able to be able to do the same kind of combat I can do in the regular game, everything should be fine. Alright, what else? Alright. Oh, 
ってしまうたちやあの兄ちゃん答えな<笑>俺だって分かってるさこの土佐で上司に逆らったらどうなるかなんてことはない<笑>ここにいる誰よりずっとな<笑>なんとは悔しくないのか。I'd beat their ass is what I'd do. I'd make sure they wouldn't. I don't care. Like, you might care about honor, dude, but when it comes to this, I'd beat every single person. Yes, yes, he does accept it. Let me guess, he's gonna hit me, right? Nope. そこまでだ。誰だお前が言うところの石を蹴れる側の人間だ。何まさか。江戸に追わす大殿、山内陽道の懐刀。とでも言えばわかるか。<笑>吉田東ということだ。ずいぶん丹念に痛めつけられたものだな。おやすさん、俺。何も言うな。Well, I wasn't expecting that. The high leader of these guys is his dad. Map. 
So that's where we gotta go. Okay, what's this right there? Do I have any money so I can buy stuff? I can't see what that is at the top corner. Uh, I have uh, six. Six real. I guess that's the money system in this game. No, like yen is Japanese money, but that there is called oil. So I'm going to assume that's what they called it back then. Save the game. What? So I'm gonna be right back.
Anyway, um, I'm going to leave parody for now, okay, Mask? But I'll join you later, right? Mask? いらっしゃいませ。うん。ありがとうございました。
いらっしゃいませ。高知城で隠しきばった連中と飲む酒はまずくてな酒はここで飲むに限るおやつさんどうだ龍馬傷にしみるかもしれんが数年ぶりに飲まないか<音楽>しかしせっかく江戸にまで出してやったのにな剣の修行じゃ少年は鍛えられなかったか土佐に帰るなり上司と喧嘩と相変わらずなのは土佐の上司たちの方さ江戸行って分かったが<笑>しかしあんなことをしてお前を逃がしたおやさんは土佐の賛成なんだろうそれがか土佐のお偉い老人たちのことだが問題ないさっきの老番は白札合士だどういうことだ白札は合士と上司の中間何かあればすぐ合士に格を落とすそうやって権力にこびるようなやつはそういうああお前みたいに後先考えねえ
しかしこの場ああ思い出すなもう10年以上経つかああ上司に身内を殺されわしはそんな子供たちをほんの少しでも引き取ろうと塾を作った犯人は内緒でな俺は今でも不思議に思うどうしておやっさんは上司でありながらあんなことをしたんださあどうしてだろうなだが一つ言えるのはわしは父さんが大嫌いだってことだ嫌いああ土佐は階級が絶対的な国だ武士だけでも上司白札合士、士そして合士の三階級が存在する土佐藩は同じ武士であるはずの人間にそういった階級を与え身分の壁を作ることによって藩の秩序を守ってきただが本来武士も農民も商人も女も子供も全ては同じ人間さなんてねえんだああだからわしはそんな土佐に恨みを持つお前たちを塾に引き取った土佐を変えられる人間を育てるためにな土佐を変えられる人間そうだ階級という制度に飼いならされた人間には変えたいという気持ちは生まれないわしはな龍馬土佐を変えられる人間ってな土佐を誰よりも愛し土佐を誰よりも憎んでいるやつだと思うんだお前は15年前上司に家を焼かれ実の親兄弟を失ったお前は土佐を変えたいと願っているはずだおやさんうんじゃあどうしておやさんは藩の仕事をしているんだふん<笑>藩の賛成ってのは土佐の階級制度を守る立場なんじゃねえのかそうだ龍馬今日お前死ぐあ,あ土佐今目それわし怖っ竹龍馬武しに会いに行けそして土佐勤王党に入るんだ<音声>とにかく。ミントソンかもしれんで、ね。